Hey guys, what's going on? Matt the Caveman Cunier here again from Paleo Problem Long Island and MattheCaveman.com. Today's question is, what is the absolute worst food to eat? I'm the Caveman! And the answer is... Bacon. Wait a minute, what vegan got in and changed the script? No, no, no. It's one of the best. Now, this question came about thanks to a conversation I had this morning at Long Island and May, my good friends Brian, Justin, and Matt, and we were discussing it. We the worst. And that one is a little bit squirrely of a question because there's a lot of variables that come into play. What do you have going on in your life? That being said, there are some serious offenders that could go up towards the top. And among those, we have things like bagels, chips, french fries, pizza. But if I absolutely had to pick just one, I'd probably have to go with donuts. The reason being, you're going to get a whack of sugar, of refined flour, and generally refined seed oils. So you're going to take in a huge bolus of sugar, which is going to throw off your insulin, put you on that blood sugar roller coaster. From there, the grains, even though they're in the refined form, still going to have some gut damage being done. And because they're refined, it's going to be another whack of sugar. After that, those vegetable oils are going to be a source of omega-6 fatty acids, which we already consume too much of as a culture. But to make matters worse, they can be hydrogenated, resulting in the creation of trans fats, and if they're heated to too high of temperature, could form potential carcinogens. So overall, just not good. You're messing up your gut, messing up your hormones, you're instituting a state of inflammation, and potentially introducing some carcinogens. Now, that's a big of a bold statement, that last one, but you get where I'm going with this. Either way, Donuts probably will be the worst food you could possibly eat. So, your biggest takeaways are, what are the worst foods? Probably donuts. But, there are a host of other processed foods that are going to be a problem as well. Just eat real food, okay? Avoid the garbage, avoid the processed stuff, the refined vegetable oils, avoid the refined flours and sugars. Most added sugars are gonna be a problem. Most grains and legumes are gonna be a problem. So you're putting them all together with a garbage oil, you're setting yourself up for major problems. But this all comes with a caveat. The worst food for you is the one that triggers you. If you're a salty person, then those chips and fries are gonna be towards the top of the list. If you're somebody that needs that starchy carb, then maybe it's pizza or bagels. Be aware of what is going to be a problem for you, and that is the absolute worst food. Now, regarding that conversation I mentioned earlier that sparked this video, my buddy Brian actually recorded a whole bunch of it. He started without me knowing, but maybe he'll release that. We'll see what happens. Either way, you know what to do. Like and subscribe down below. Share it with your friends. Head over to Instagram and Twitter and follow me at Mike the Caveman over on Facebook at Paleo Problem Long Island and of course over at MikeTheCaveman.com. That being said, have a long rest of your day. Enjoy this beautiful weather. I'm so glad to be out here again, but I'll see you tomorrow. Due to poor circulation, injuries or overuse, stress, I'm the caveman.